what's up everyone on YouTube today I'm gonna be talking about what do I think of Will Smith slapping um, Chris Rock now I know this is gonna be this is gonna be my own opinion video it doesn't have to be whatever you say on YouTube well despite I was reading on an article about this kind of stuff what I, was, what I was reading so you can pause that video and read it and uh, he was almost gonna get arrested now I don't like to talk about this on YouTube I'm, I'm a very private person but because I hear this and I thought this is like disgusting why not I talk about it why not I say about my opinions with this guy slapping Chris Rock because this is really interesting <laughs> hold on hold on hold on let me start talking about it first of all first of is you got a guy who he does comedian and it's his job now with people who are comedians their job is to make people laugh okay now if i was in a position and i saw a person all right <clears throat> let's say for example I get a joke about someone making fun of my face, for example. Do I look like I'm gonna get up and slap a person's face just for someone making fun of my face? Hell no. They're just comedians. Just just consider it as a roast. I mean, for example, when I was on a live video on, uh, I don't know if you've heard of an app called Scout. It's like a live video, you meet someone. It's like a dating site and a live as well. And uh, basically, you get people many times that make fun of you on live video. So it's kind of like in real life, you get people making fun of you. Whereas you're on a live video and you make people, you get people from around the world making fun of you. Like they've never met you before. They've never seen, you know, seen you before. Like, for example, like your culture or whatever. They're going to be like, oh, you got ugly face and all that. Well, it's like what Chris Rock was doing. He was making fun of um will smith's wife but he didn't mean it when he made fun of him i mean he's just a comedian he's just doing his job he's just getting paid for what he's doing but let me put that as an example i mean i i got my favorite comedian who i love and my favorite comedian is uh, for example jerry seinfeld and jim carrey but jerry seinfeld He's also a comedian as well. I've watched his comedian shows. I mean, I used to watch it on YouTube. And if you watch his his show, everyone loves his jokes. Everyone appreciates it. Now, <clears throat> I can assume Jerry Seinfeld could have heard of Chris Rock getting slapped by Will Smith. I'm pretty sure he would be surprised and and be like, oh shit, what have I seen? He's probably like, reading like the articles and going like whoa what's going on well, well why is he getting slapped in the middle of the the oscars i mean like even my friend i have a friend of mine he even says that's stupid i mean you're embarrassing yourself to slap someone i mean take a look at this clip as a previous i mean Instead of just slapping, can't you just use your brain and just say, Hey, buddy, I don't like the way how you said to my wife. I don't like this. You know, please don't talk like that to my wife. My wife has this sickness. I don't want to say that name, but you can see it here. If I was Will Smith, instead of me slapping, I would just say, Hey, Chris Rock, come here. Yes. Can you like stop talking like that to my wife? I really appreciate it if you don't talk like this in front of everybody. I don't like that. Okay. He would have said that. He would have said it. He would have stopped this problem. But instead he just used violence to like slap. Well, slapping is a violent. So not only that, I mean, what about the kids? They're watching stuff on, on internet and then they're gonna be thinking this is right. But you know who's responsible would it be if the kids are watching this? The parents. The parents should be responsible for their kids not to watch stuff on internet. Because everything that that people put on internet or either 
it doesn't matter which which social network you name it anything kids will always watch it but to be honest with you with that slap it's gonna be there forever it's gonna be there forever chris rock would have just reported it to the police i mean the police the lapd they wanted to file uh charges against will smith but chris rock had a good heart for the way i look at him he has a very good heart he's like no 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 charges no charges against mr will smith like that so in another words he doesn't want to do it he doesn't want to have that big headache he doesn't he knew i wouldn't say he knew he just doesn't want that headache from the looks of it but judging from that it's gonna the video of the slap is gonna be there forever and the sad thing is <laughs> will smith is banned for 10 years going to the academy award have a think about this just write me a comment down below what you think see this is just my video my own opinion i don't have anything to say about will smith and chris rock all I can say is, it's embarrassing. You just don't do that in front of thousands of people. Whereas if you have a family and you just slap someone next to your family, that's a different story. But still, that's embarrassing. You don't slap someone in the face. I mean, the way I look at it with a slap is like when you, when you have a girl that... Uh, Alright, when you cheated on a girl, a girl usually slaps you in the face. That's how I hear this slap all right that's how i hear the slap all right many people get slapped but not on the public come on man that's it for today i hope everyone has an awesome day um just uh stay positive and uh don't do slap like will smith and uh remember flaming joe is out